We're on Jazz Street at the Xerox Hospitality Tent, and please state your name for the record. Abby Gramado. Elijah Harrow. Wow, and uh, you guys have really been the stars this week at the Jazz Festival, playing outside at Eastman Theater and all over our, on Main Street. So how long have you been playing sax, Abby? Uh, about three years. How about you? Um, same, kind of about, you know, three, two and a half years. So what made you want to start playing? Well, I thought the saxophone was a really cool instrument, and I played the French horn a little before, but saxophone's cooler. How about for you? Um, well, my dad played the trumpet, and he played jazz, and then I kind of wanted to get into it. Because, you know, I like brass, so yeah, that's what made me want to start. What are some of your favorite tunes to play? Uh, Doxy, Bemsha Swing, Coming Home Baby. Uh, like Cold Duck Time, Midnight Creeper, um, you know, what's another? So, uh huh, Hank Mobley. So, Lou, so you'll have Lou Donaldson, Eddie Harris, Miles Davis, Sonny Rollins. Yep. Yeah, I like those guys. Who else do you like to listen to? What else do you listen to? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I like jazz, just in general. How about you, man? Uh, I like Wynton Marcellus. And then, like, you know, cooler kind of jazz with, like, Alan Vizzuti jazz stuff. He's good, yeah. And now let's talk to your dad, Steve Harrow. Steve, this is pretty amazing stuff. So why is it so important to get kids involved with music so early? The great thing about music is it captures the attention of the whole person at the same time. And what I mean by the whole person is your intellect, your emotion, uh, your aesthetics, which is your sense of beauty, your physical capabilities. And if you take it as far, you can even talk about the spiritual if you, you know we play a worship band together in church. So the whole, it's a whole person activity. So it, it allows every part of you to express itself at once. I think it's a pretty amazing thing. So I think it's a really healthy thing for kids to do. There it is. So again, as a plug for playing jazz, start them young, right? Oh, yeah, because uh, you have to get acclimated towards the concept. You have to have it in your head. And then uh, it can be manifested when you study the theory. And you kind of put it all together through the years with, while you're, when you're practicing. Yeah. Now, I've noticed that they, they play a lot of the great blue note classics, the blues stuff. Is that, on, is that by design? Is that on purpose? They got most of those tunes from their director, Douglas Stone. You'll hear Junior Jazz at 6 o'clock on the main stage here in Gibbs. So he uh, very wisely gave them the kind of material that they could master fairly easily. A lot of it's using the blues scale. So they, they caught on to it right away. Score one for jazz. Thanks, kids. Yep. Yeah, thanks. That was fun.